Georg Wilhelm Friedrich Hegel, August 27, 1770, November 14, 1831, was a German philosopher of the late Enlightenment. He achieved wide renown in his day and, while primarily influential within the continental tradition of philosophy, has become increasingly influential in the analytic tradition as well. Although he remains a divisive figure, his canonical stature within Western philosophy is universally recognized. Hegel's principal achievement is his development of a distinctive articulation of idealism sometimes termed absolute idealism, in which the dualisms of, for instance, mind and nature and subject and object are overcome. His philosophy of spirit conceptually integrates psychology, the state, history, art, religion, and philosophy. His account of the master-slave dialectic has been highly influential, especially in 20th century France. Of special importance is his concept of spirit, Geist, sometimes also translated as mind, as the historical manifestation of the logical concept in the sublation, offabun, integration without elimination or reduction of seemingly contradictory or opposing factors. Examples include the apparent opposition between nature and freedom and between immanence and transcendence. Hegel has been seen in the 21st century as the originator of the thesis, antithesis, synthesis triad. However this originated with Johann Fichte. Hegel has influenced many thinkers and writers whose own positions vary widely. Karl Barth described Hegel as a Protestant Aquinas, while Maurice Merleau-Ponty wrote that all the great philosophical ideas of the past century, the philosophies of Marx and Nietzsche, phenomenology, German existentialism, and psychoanalysis, had their beginnings in Hegel. Some of Hegel's writing were intended for those with advanced knowledge of philosophy, although his encyclopedia was intended as a textbook and a university course. Nevertheless, Hegel assumes that his readers are well-versed in Western philosophy, 